Guys, I'm making this video about why not to date single moms, but in this video I'm going to keep you at the center. A lot of these videos talk about uh, bad things about single mom. I am not focused on that. I don't care if the world is bad. In fact, I deal with a lot of bad people. I work in investment banking. I have been to the Middle East. I have been uh, doing business with a lot of human rights violations. Uh, done by the Israeli army in the Middle East. I don't care about bad things happening. I don't care about bad people. I don't care about anything. I just want to increase my ROI. I just want to make me feel good. I'm focused on my life. I want my success. And this video is being made, keeping me at the center, keeping you at the center, keeping what you want to achieve in life as the center. So no bashing. No bad words, no hard emotion, just you at the center. Let's understand why it's a bad team. And there are 10 points to that. The first is, if somebody behaves privileged, if somebody behaves entitled, and if somebody behaves victim at the same time, it's a big mental problem. You don't want to be in that kind of a state where somebody is behaving in that way. Plus, when you date single mom, you become beta male, which is... Beta male don't kill the child of the other man that's come that's coming from animals. That animal behavior makes girls attracted to criminals and drug dealers. And she cannot feel attracted to you. There would be no blowjob, there would be no come swallow, there would be no anal sex, there would be no domination in sex, and you won't be satisfied in your life. It's a big problem. Now some people might say that sex with single mom was good. That good was to lock you in. That good was not because you are an alpha male, you are a strong male. You, when you decide to do such a stupid thing, girls understand only language of power. If you can date another girl and if you're not doing that, she won't understand the sacrifice. She would think that you are weak. And girls are made by nature to eliminate weak men through evolution. For a long time, half of the men were not able to reproduce and the best man had many girls. Nature through evolution is using girls to weed out the weak genes. So you cannot be on the other side of the wall. We are going to talk about that in another point. Number two, you are not number one. Your targets are not number one because you are not number one. You cannot become a millionaire when you do that. Number three, every second invested in this bastard kid, you are creating your own enemy because this guy is this kid is going to create trouble for you because he's going to hate you in the future. You lose time worth of millions. Number four, rewarding bad behavior and not rewarding good behavior of single girls. You are doing injustice to all the nice single girls who are there. By not rewarding good behavior of single girls, yeah, the masculine energy, the males have always rewarded good behavior. That's how we built up the society. Number five, you're propagating genes of criminals, gangsters, rapists, murderers, Thieves, do you want to do that? No, not for this society. The world is unsafe for the future if you do this. Number six, baby daddy always come before you as the baby represents him, reminds him. So, that's kind of stupid. The racial factor is also very important because generally these guys are of the same race. And you come out as a different guy, so these black girls are raising black men's kid. And you as a white guy or an Asian guy or a Latino guy are raising those kids. Or some Latino girls are raising Latino race, Latino kids, and your race is going out. Yeah, I'm a racist. Frankly speaking, I am. Okay. She will save the baby dad before you if there is a situation. These girls have stolen money from my pocket and given to the druggist baby dad, to the criminal baby dad. There is an unbreakable bond with the baby dad. She sees him all the time. I'll continue in the next one.